Once again, I turned to Dr. Gelderblom, seeking proof of HIV's existence in the most recent images available. Here, you do not see anything about uh, the details, but I would say it's probably a virus. These are HIV here? Yeah. Oh, the, so the, are the, these HIV too? Yeah, yeah. Everything's Probably. HIV. Probably. Probably. Yeah. Because I believe HIV, we can be exposed to HIV many times without being chronically infected. Our immune system could get rid of the virus within a few weeks if you have a good immune system. And this now, one thing you said, you were talking about the fact that if you have a built immune system, it is possible to get rid of HIV naturally. If, if you take a poor African who's been infected and you build up their immune system, is it possible for them to also naturally get rid of it? I would think so. Particles, but they did not have the morphology typical of retroviruses. Jamel he insisted to, uh, to find why, how it was possible that they did not publish when they claimed that they have purified it. And then his, and they, in the purified virus, they did not have typical, even, even retrovirus-like particles, much less HIV and much less purified. Montagnier repeated, I repeat, we did not purify it. Well, what's the purpose of the purification then? Well, to, uh, to make sure uh, uh, you have a, a real virus, uh, you know, uh, 